Nice! <laughs> Guys, we got a new toy, and this is the Kyo Show MP10 Tiki 2. No, Kim, <laughs> you can't call it a Tiki 2. It's a TKI 2. We got a Kyo Show fanboy <laughs> in the house. It stands for Team Kyo Show International. <laughs> Mark two. Give us a guided tour then, what we got? We've got the latest Inferno MP10 TKI 2. Latest Reds engine, Scuderia Super Velocity. Latest from the Rossi crew in Italy. The Reds pipe, F3 approved. Hold on, Mick, 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 Mick. You've got to do the YouTube voice. What, am I a Kyle Show fanboy then? No, 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 you've got to do it like this. What are these called? Sanwar servos. And we've got some Sanwar servos! <laughs> Give it a go. And we've got some Samwa servos. That's better. And we've got another Samwa servo. <laughs> and we've got a Samwa optional switch. <laughs> Aluminium hubs. And a Samwa receiver. And some titanium Kyosho turnbuckles. Now, I've not got a clue how to build it, so Mick's going to build it. And then we're going to take it to the skate park and give it hell. You reckon? <laughs> Why, is that not what we're doing? <laughs> This is a race car, Kev. But we can do it. It's strong enough, do it. <laughs> if, if the viewers want to watch it, strike below, innit? Yeah. Comment down below if you want to see it. Or is it escape. smash the bell? Yeah, you can smash the I'm bell. Getting, I'm getting used to all this YouTubing. Can I smash the bell? Yeah, go on, smash it. Smash the bell! Oh, check out all these goodies in there, guys. The Tiki 2. Actually, what is it? TKI2? Yeah. All right, so TKI2, guys. Don't get it wrong. So this is Yuichi Kanai, who's designed the Kyosho Inferno range range since 1989? Yes. Yeah, all right, there we go. Basically, guys, this is the Rolls Royce when it comes to one ape scale nitro racing buggies. This is the pinnacle, this is the best, and we've got the best man in the house to build it. And I love it. <laughs> so if you don't know who Mick Craddock is and you're into 18th Rally Cross, then you've been living under a rock. So Mick's been racing 18th Rally Cross since 1989. He's won four over 40s British Championships, three over 40s European Championships. He built, set up, and pitmanned the winning cars to go ahead and win four British Championships and two European Championships. And Mick's also pitmanned for Mark Pavidis. No, it's Mark Pavidis. All right, Mark Pavidis to TQ and win the 2006 World Championship. Victory for Mark Pavidis. Lab, he drops his transmitter to the pit crew. If you want to see that all in great detail, I'm going to put a link to all that lot down below. So if I get this built in 10 hours, Kev, are you going to let me drive your Lambo? There's no chance you're building that in 10 hours. There we go, we set the clock. If Mick can do it in under 10 hours, he can drive it. TKR2 has the longer shocks on this one now, so you get more droop, better suspension for uh, bumpier tracks. And you've got the new body, not so high side guards, lower front downforce on the front. All of these cutouts obviously to design to save weight. So here's how far he's gotten so far. Here's the rear diff assembly. Check out the quality of these parts, guys. Here's the diffs all assembled. All right, let's see if we can hold him up a bit. Okay, well. <laughs> you alright? Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, bits everywhere. <laughs> you got nothing better to do. Yeah, I'll, I'll go. I'll go and edit. I'll leave you to it. <laughs> oh, he's getting close. You got it started yet, Kev? What's going on? That was flat. When's the last time you started last it? Last time that ran was probably about, probably the summer last. We've got to take you through a rip in this weather. Yeah. Nothing. Yeah. 10 point something. Oh, battery's flat. Let's put it on charge. And that's your, um, your build done. 
Guys, if you want to see the complete build with all the tips and tricks that Mick, with 30 years experience, has used to build and set up multiple European and British Championship winning cars, how to tune engines, maintenance, driving tips, suspension setup and everything else, then check out the link in the description. Oh, I've done it. I think I've done it. Kev, I've done it. You ain't done it, have you? Yeah, I have. I have a look at the time. You haven't put the tyres on it. You haven't painted the body. You're joking. Can I at least rev it then? Yeah, you can rev it. Let's see if it starts. Are you going to take this out for a rip then, if it starts? All right, let's see if it works. Servicing doing, that's where you gotta go. Here's the main man. <laughs> oh, we get the traction control off. Well, that's it, go past oh, now. Can you put the traction control back on, please? Get on. <laughs> <laughs> ah, where's the fun in there? Were you scared? Yeah, I was actually shitting my pants. I thought you was putting it on for the video. No, because you said oh, I haven't been out for four months. I'm <laughs> just getting used to it again. So he's and actually you, scared? Yeah, and you switched the traction control off, and then I'm like, oh, going oh, two wheel drive for some reason. I'm thinking <laughs> we're going backwards into an arm co. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm sorry, mate. I'm going to have to take my blood pressure now. Have <laughs> you cleaned the seat? No skid marks in them. Yeah, I'll see it's all right. <laughs> yeah, I'll send you a picture of me pants later, Kev. <laughs> So now, let's start it up for the first time and run in the engine. So we're just putting an old set of tyres on. It's no good using a uh, new set. So what we need to do is prime the engine. So we push down on the starter just to make sure it turns over all right. So I've got the throttle full open. You can hear that. You can see some fuel blowing out now. Leave the glow igniter on for 10 seconds. And there you go. So after what seemed to be like forever, the car is finally run in and ready to rip. And that's your car set, ready to go to the track. It's an hour day and hopefully we can get Mick to take out the new Inferno and hit a couple of skate parks. Cars UK, Mike Craddock speaking. Hey, how you doing? Oh mate. Are we uh, going to hit a couple of skate parks with this Inferno? Not with a new one, you ain't. No. Oh, what? I've got my old MP10. It's pretty much the same. It's my old race one from the Nationals last year. Yeah. You can use that. That'll be all right on a skate park. Yeah, all right, mate. That'll do. I'll see you over there then. Nice one. See you in a bit, Bye. dude. Bye. Bye. We are on location. We've got the skate park over there, but at the moment, we're just keeping it on there, so we're going to leave that for now we're just going to give it a rip on this track here so what car is this one mick it's the mp10 not the tkr2 but the mp10 so you got the latest body on there so what's the difference on this compared to the new one new one's got longer shocks on it let her rip boy Oh, 
Really clear the whole lot. Oh, nearly. Nice. Loves it, doesn't it? Oh. 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 Happened. New location. Oh, is that going to the moon? No, that's not. Oh, that one? This, yeah, this one. Is that going to the moon? Yes, to the moon. Your spares? Yeah. Yes. Don't forget guys, if you want to learn all the tips and tricks and knowledge that Mick has built up over the past 30 years to win multiple championships all over the world, then click on the link down below for more info.